Hi guys, I'm Peter Mbari from the University of Nairobi Science and Technology Park. I'm Bonfess Muganda from the University of Nairobi studying computer science. And me too, I'm Telewa Emmanuel from Computer Science Nairobi University. Uh, we'd also like to recognize the efforts by our friend Pasila Njira from Ijaton University. And uh, we are here to present to you the Beat Harvester. Welcome. Okay. Our project name is Beat Harvester. We are competing in the open hardware category. We are from Nairobi, Kenya. Our challenge was posted by Access Kenya, a company that provides energy service to Kenyans in rural, remote areas that are disadvantaged by the infrastructure in electricity such that uh, they don't have access to energy. Now, Access Energy has so many wind turbines that are in those remote areas and uh, uh, controlling them and monitoring them is a big, big, big problem. So the challenge was posted that we should be able to acquire the data about the operation of the wind turbine regarding voltage, current, wind speed, and uh, the various other parameters that are related to the operation of a wind turbine. And we came up with a solution. So during the Space Apps Challenge, we came up with the Bit Harvester, which is a data acquisition and control system that uh, relies on the GSM technology and also on a microcontroller and a myriad of sensors that can be used to monitor the various parameters associated with the operation of a wind turbine. So the microcontroller with the sensors around it collects the data. All that is, uh, information is put in an SMS and is stored database. That way, all the information about the operation of the wind turbine can be collected in a central place regarding so many wind turbines out there in the remote areas and it becomes very easy to monitor and also control them. Now it's time to see how the system works. This is the GSM module. This one is the microcontroller and this one is a potentiometer uh, depicting a sensor. So I'm going to send an SMS from my phone to control to control the bulb. Yeah. This SMS is to light the bulb or uh, to switch the bulb on. As you can see, the bulb is off. Now I will send the SMS. Yeah, we are sending. Yeah, just a few moments. Yes, and there we go. The bulb is lighting. And on this other side, we have our SMS database, you can see. We have a log of all the information that the system has been sending. Uh, the application of this idea and this project uh, will really help directly, especially in the case of Access Energy, who have many windmills. If they apply this, it will be very easy to manage and control their windmills from a central point without worrying about wherever the, the windmills are located. Yeah. And in the long run, it will enable them to expand and to deploy more windmills all over the place so that more and more people can have access to energy, which is a very, very, very essential uh, commodity when it comes to development in this country, especially the advancement of the Millennium Development Goals. So guys, this application is really great. I hope you have enjoyed and I want you guys to vote for us. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>